Hello everyone, welcome back in today's tutorial on Informatica MDM SIF that is Service Integration Framework. In today's tutorial, we'll, we will see what is SIF and what is SIF SDK. In today's tutorial, we are going to see what are the prerequisites before going to learn about the SIF. What is SIF? Details about the SIF SDK, use cases for SIF SDK, and one of the important class, Cyprian Client Library, in the library of the SIF. So, what are the prerequisites before you go to learn Informatica MDM SIF? The first required prerequisite is we should know about the Informatica MDM. Regarding the technologies, we should aware about the core Java and the advanced Java, particularly EJB. Then, we should know other technologies such as XML, SO, and HTTP. What is SIF? SIF is abbreviation for Services Integration Framework. It is used to invoke MDM hub operations from external applications. The external application can be in Java technology, .NET technology, or any other technology. We can invoke the MDM hub operation with use of SIF, that is Services Integration Framework. Let's have a look on a more important point about SIF. SIF uses service-oriented architecture and that provides application functionality as a service. So if you know the service-oriented architecture that is popularly known as SOA, it provides the applications which act as a service. So SIF, it's a framework or it's, it's framework which use in the so architecture to provide what are this MDM access operations are there are as a service. If you know the client service model where client server model where we have the client application like any JSP HTTP or ASP.NET application that act as a client then we have the server like any application server like JPOS, WebLogic, WebSphere and at the middle tier the middle where applications available such as Enterprise Java Bay. So the SIF act as middle tier application in client server model. So there will be a client application at the back end there will be database and the communication between the client application and the database will be happen through SIF. The existing infrastructures such as Enterprise Service Bus that is ESB and Enterprise Application Integration that is EAI technologies such as TIPCO, web methods, message oriented middleware can be used with service services integration framework that is Informatica SIF. There is one more important point. If you go to the Informatica MDM Hub security model, that is SAM model, you will find we can make secured resources. What are those secured resources? There are two types of resources. One is private and second is secured. Private resources are always access within the MDM hub only. However, secure resources can be accessed within MDM hub as well as outside the MDM hub such as through the SIF or through IDD. Now, suppose you want to access some of the private members from the SIF. Uh, from, if you want to access the private member of Informatica MDM through SIF API then make sure the user you are going to use 
to call the SIP API should have the admin privileges. Then and then only you can call the private resources. So this is very important note. Only admin users can access the private resources through the SIP request. However, the other resources which are secure resources, those can be accessed through the SIP request by any other user privilege. SIF SDK Services Integration Framework Source Development Kit so that is called SIF SDK the SIF SDK includes utilities to build and deploy SIF applications the SIF SDK includes also a set of Java classes in order to create services or standalone application SIP SDK is used to develop web services and Java applications. Here, the Java applications are nothing but the standalone applications. So web services and Java applications interact the Informatica MDM hub through this SIP API or the, through SIP SDK. SIP SDK is also called as a SIP APIs in general term. SIP SDK is packed with MDM Hub Resource Kit Installer. So, in order to install SIP SDK, you have to use the Resource Kit Installer and follow some steps to install Resource Kit. Installation Directory Resource Kit Installation Directory Whenever you install Resource Kit using the Resource Kit Installer, it will ask us one directory you can provide any custom directory or you can use a directory inside hub resource kit sdk and cf sdk what is the use of what are the use cases of cif we can use cif in order to develop web services to perform operations in mdm hub so the first use to create web service. Second thing, we can use the SIF in order to build business process modeling that is called BPM and workflow integration by using Java API or SOAP directly. SIF also can be used to develop a Java Swing UI that is nothing but a standalone application Java standalone application in order to query, view, and edit the data which is available in Informatica MDM Hub. It also used to create server components or rather the middleware component in a J2E application server in order to get, update, or create data in MDM Hub. One of the best example is nothing but Enterprise Java Bean. Yes, we can create Enterprise Java Bean and use the SIF, AI, SIF APIs or the SIF SDK to communicate with Informatica MDM Hub. SIF also used to develop a web application which is based on either server, Java server pages that is JSP or servlet. So using JSP and servlet we can develop the web application and in the web application, we can call the SIF API to achieve the communication between the client application and the MDM hub. Let's have a look on one of the uh, few of the classes from the Cyprint client library. There is a class called as com.cyprint.sif.client.cyprint client. It consists of process method which is very important method and it is used to implement the request and the response integration. So every application communicates with the Informatica MDM hub through the request and the application also get the response from the MDM hub. So to achieve the, this interaction between the client and the MDM hub that happens through Cyprian client and by using process method. 
These classes are available inside com.cyperin.sif.message.mrm and com.cyperin.sif.message.hm packages which include the request and response objects. com.cyperin.sif.client package manages the details of the client communication with MDM hub protocols such as EJP, XML over HTTP or SOAP is used to communicate between the client and the MDM hub. Let's have a look on the SDK. As we said, so there are various packages available inside SDK and this is the documentation page. If you go and open uh, index.html which is available inside the installation directory, here you can see the com.cyperin package, cyperin client. So, SIF client consists of the classes which will actually will be used to see the communication between the client and the MDM hub. So, we have EJB cyperin client. EJB Transaction Factory in IMPL, HTTP Cyperin Client, JBoss 7 Transaction Factory IMPL, Cyperin Client, and SOAP Cyperin Client. Out of this, Cyperin Client is generic form of all other clients. The exception are which are being thrown from the SIF are SIF Client Exception, SIF Communication Exception, Cyperin Oh, the, sorry, Cyprian client exception, Cyprian communication exception, Cyprian server exception. The other package we just discussed are nothing but the MRM and the HM. Let's have a look on the MRM and the HM package. So, this is Cyprian MRM. It has way of uh, exception like MRM exception and the package one which reside inside the message which consists of request and response for the all the operations like clean spoot request clean spoot response this is the one of the example of request response for the clean spoot operation then we have the hm package which are relate which consists of the request response related to the hierarchy manager in the informatica mdm in upcoming session, we will see more details about all these packages. I hope this introductory session about the Informatica MDM SIF will help you to understand little more about the SIF. Thank you for watching the video and have a wonderful time.